What is so funny? <laughs> I ordered the Nintendo Switch for you. You lie. <laughs> you sure? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> All right, guys, so what you see right here is another gift from my amazing wife, Solange. You've seen her in my vlogs. She's my better half, my partner in crime. She's given me so much from my retro consoles to my 3DS to my Wii U. And honestly, without her love and support, I probably wouldn't have the collection that I have today. Words cannot express how grateful I am to have her in my life. But anyway, this is why you clicked on the video, right? So let's start unboxing. All right, so let's take a good look at the box here. Here we have the front, I believe is the front. Uh, it shows the switch is actually docked and you got the two Joy-Cons with the, um, God, what the heck is this thing called? The Joy-Con holder, the, the, uh, the grip, yeah, that thing. Uh, Nintendo Switch logo on the top it says Nintendo on the sides all the different ways the switch can be used on the back we have the switch in portable form showing how the joy cons actually uh, attach and detach uh, on the other side more pictures of the switch and people using the switch and the joy cons connected to their straps bottom has all the good warnings and barcodes and all that good stuff but that's only the box let's open it one tab out next tab out uh let's turn this around here uh we got more stuff on the bottom how to set it up and when we open it up here is the switch it's kind of like a little tablet this is the actual console it's just like a tablet let's, let's take it out of the uh, plastic here I'm about to get my fingerprints all over it look at that on the top can insert the game card right up here you got your headphone jack volume controls power button uh, on the sides are where the you uh, connect the joy cons bottom USB-C charging standard and it actually has if I can get it out without breaking it ah there we go it has a kickstand so you can stand it up obviously so let's put that back right there. We'll take out the Joy-Cons. They're a lot more neon than I thought they would be. As like from looking at pictures, there's a big difference like between having them in your hand and looking at the pictures obviously, but I mean like the colors are so vibrant on these things. It's crazy. They feel very nice. They feel very natural. So, if I take this out, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, that felt so good. Nice. So that is the switch in portable form. Let's gonna, we're gonna set that off to the side. Take this out. Let's look at what else is in the box. Instructions, we all know we have to follow instructions. Uh, let's see what else is in here. Oh, here we go. This is the, uh, what I couldn't say before. This is the uh, Joy-Con grip. So, let's see. Let, let's take the Joy-Con out. Oh, I just turned it on. Look at that. Holy crap. Anyways, uh... I don't know how to take the Joy-Con out. Ooh! Very nice.
Oh, I figured it out. I figured it out. You gotta press the little button right back here to release the Joy-Con. I see there, okay, and then the other side. Very nice. And then these will slide into the grip. Not bad. It's actually not bad. I still want to get the uh, Pro Controller later on. But for now, this will definitely do. I like the way this feels. Alright, besides that, we have our HDMI cable. We have our power with the USB-C connector. Good stuff. And the Joy-Con strap. Oh, okay. Oh, there's the other one. It comes with two, so these uh, these Joy-Cons can actually be used as individual controllers. So one for player one, one for player two. You basically have two controllers right out of the box, which is freaking awesome. And last but not least, with a whole bunch of bubble wrap, the switch dock. So on the sides we have two USB ports. On the back, uh, I think this thing opens up. Ah, there we go. We have uh, pretty much a wire control, so we don't have a whole mess of wires all over the place. Inside we have the charge port uh, USB 3.0 slot and the HDMI slot, obviously, for the HDMI cable. So let's put that there. I'm going to take these Joy-Cons out. Slide that in. and the switch is docked. All right, everything is nice and clean. So I decided to put my switch right there on top of my Wii U since I have like literally like no room for anything else. I do plan on getting some new shelf units in the near future. So I'll make an update video on that. Uh, but for now, that's where the switch will stay. Got the uh, Joy-Con straps hanging right there underneath my Mario and Bowser caps. And the Joy-Con grip has been added to my lovely box of controllers down there. Alright, so let's get this thing set up. So for games, I have Zelda Breath of the Wild, of course. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, of course, and Has Been Heroes, interesting looking game, so I'm going to try this out one, one of these days, but right now I think I'm going to play some Mario Kart. Okay, so here is Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, let's use my blade just to slice that plastic open right there. And tear this thing apart. There we go. It has been unwrapped. All right, let's open it up. And that's the game. So tiny. But they they did say that they were gonna go back to uh, these little card types. I guess it makes sense because it's a portable system. So let's open the top right here. And. This should slide in. And we are good to go. Hey! 
So this concludes my unboxing and setup of my Nintendo Switch. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe to me if you haven't done so already. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out and take care.